Hi everyone, I'm Mitali and I'm going to be talking about the TikTok data scientist interview process. At the end of this video, you should have a good understanding of the process itself, what interviewers look at and a bunch of tips for each round. A quick intro. I'm from Prepfully. This video has been put together by TikTok data scientists who are also interview coaches on Prepfully. They've coached hundreds of candidates through the process and can be booked directly on the website if you need more personalized guidance. Right then, moving on to the interview. There are three main rounds, initial screening, technical screening, and on-site. Let's dig deeper into each round, starting with the recruiter screen, which typically lasts 30 minutes. I have three tips for this round. Number one, it often starts with the old favorite, tell me about yourself. So it's useful to have a brief and engaging introduction ready to roll. Number two, recruiters typically peruse through your resume and ask questions about your past projects. So think ahead and pinpoint a couple of impactful stories beforehand. Focus on topics like what your contribution was, how things went and what you could have done better. Finally, you can expect the classic why TikTok and why data science. So make sure you have a clear reason for why you're applying at TikTok specifically, why in that role. Next up is the technical screening, which is usually broken into two rounds, the tech screen one and tech screen two. In the first round of technical screening, you will be asked to tackle some medium difficulty lead code style problems. Here the focus will be on fundamental concepts like data structures, algorithms, basic statistics and ML. Make sure to brush up on those. You will also face at least one SQL question. Make sure you have a solid grasp of the built-in functions in SQL. Throughout the challenge, make sure to ask for feedback or suggestions and try out different approaches to solve the problems. Now, as for the second text screen, this one is typically a deep dive of your resume followed by a technical discussion. They'll be looking for examples of any hands-on experience you have or specific projects or challenges you've tackled. Make sure you've got a couple up your sleeve. You can also expect some math, A-B testing questions. It's always recommended to practice these technical screens. You will find several TikTok data scientists on Prepfully who provide great advice and guidance on how to tackle these rounds. Book a session with them directly. Links in the description box. Right then. On to the on-site round. You can expect three to four rounds here. First, a product sense round. Second, a stats and A-B testing interview. Finally, a behavioral culture fit and department manager interview. Sometimes you also get a take-home product analytics test, which we shall discuss in detail in the end, so make sure to stick around. Now let's unpack the on-site rounds for you. So the product sense interview is basically to see if you can build out a strategy from scratch or critique and improve an existing product. You will get questions like, what would you do if you were the PM or CEO of X company? They are typically straightforward product questions, but they'll be going into a lot of details, so be prepared for that. They want to get insight into your creativity and instincts regarding products. Next, in the stats and A-B testing round, you'll tackle statistical concepts and their use in A-B testing scenarios. They will want to see if you can apply them to real-world situations, especially in the area of product development, to make smart calls about product features. Finally, coming to the behavior and fit assessment round. Here, they'll delve into your past experiences, achievements, and challenges. Anything that gives insights into your behavior, thought process, decision-making mindset, and problem-solving skills. So these tell me about a time questions will definitely pop up. To prepare, think of specific examples from your past projects that have taught you something important. It could be overcoming a big challenge, leading a successful project, or learning from a mistake. Explain why it was valuable and what you learned from it. Then you will speak with your prospective department manager who will further assess your fit within the team. This is typically a concluding interview where they inquire about your long-term goals, your leadership style, collaboration approach, etc. So practice it with a TikTok data scientist to figure out how this interview plays out. Prepfully as excellent data scientists at TikTok with a ton of experience who can coach you. Book a one-on-one -on -one mock session with them directly using the link in the description box. Now, as promised, we'll discuss the homework assignment. 
This is essentially a product analytics test where you basically have to come up with a well thought out solution to a real world business scenario. You'll receive a short problem statement to work on and you'll need to present your case in less than 150 words. An example statement would go something like, evaluate the effectiveness of the recommendation engine feature on the TikTok platform as a data scientist. Basically, you need to pinpoint metrics to measure the impact of the recommendation engine on user engagement or retention. For instance, it could be something like click-through rate or time spent on the platform. Additional metrics could include conversion rate, user satisfaction scores, or number of repeat visits. Your task would be to show all of these collectively provide a holistic view of the feature's performance. Anyway, that's all from me. Don't forget to check out our more in-depth written guide in the video description. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching the video. If you liked it, please subscribe. Our website is prepfully.com. We've got lots of interview questions there. You can also schedule a mock interview with one of our experts. You can find the link in the description below. All the best from us at Prep Fully, and we hope you totally rock your interview.